What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Lion's Den. We are back here in Sale VR. We're gonna show you something really cool today. Uh, in one of my previous videos, I showed you guys the ship customization that's coming to the game. We've been testing it as Patreon supporters. It's going to be uh, in the public testing build soon. So you should join the Discord and join the public testing build if you're not a Patreon supporter so you can try out the ships. But they added a few new cool things that I wanted to show off today. So let's head on over to the, you know, the port over there by the beach and take a look. Now, a lot of people, if you see their videos, are going to go through all this stuff one by one, give you a lot of detail, and I am going to give you some detail. But I figured, why don't we show off the colors a little bit first, and why don't we add a little bit of spice to it? <laughs> you enjoyed that you better have enjoyed that so now we're actually going to go through in a little detail all the stuff that's new about the ship customization i'm not going to go sail out and get some treasure right now but i'll show you everything down the line of the little board you have so let's go take a look so from a first glance everything looks pretty much the same so you know you can change which way your sails face you can change which boat you want you got the speedy sails lightweight sails regular sails and now they actually added a lightweight hull, which will also make you faster, but give you less health compared to the reinforced hull, which, you know, gives you more health, but it makes you slower than standard hull. So over here, you still see your ship. And as you can see, there are now going to be prices for the different ships. So this ship right now is free. The raft is free. I think the raft should always be free. You should always be able to get a raft. Um, if you add stuff to it, look, 100 gold. So as you add things to your ship, I guess the harpoon is 50 gold. It will cost you more, but with nothing on it, no extra cost. Now, a sloop, base sloop, a thousand gold. If you want a cannon on each side and a harpoon like it is now in the base game, 1600. The runner is 5,000 base. Uh, let's try a cannon, two cannons on each side and a harpoon. That's uh, 9,500, so it does get up there when you start adding more and more stuff to your ship. So, you know, you're gonna have to pick and choose. All right, and now for the Man of War, we see the base is 25,000 gold. Um, let's just add all cannons to this Man of War, see how much it makes it cost. 65,000 gold. So that just added 40,000 to the full price of this ship. This is cool, I really like how they're doing this. I don't believe these are the final prices for everything. So, you know, it's just a work in progress, but it's cool to know that that's how it's gonna work. But of course, as you all just saw, this is what's really gonna be the, you know, breakout moment for the ships. You can now customize them in any way you want. So I showed you a little bit of that. You know, in the base game, you kind of twist the bottom and it just gives you a default little, you know, color palette. But now, right now we have classic, obviously. We have the Queen Anne's Revenge, and we have this pirate ship sail. That's pretty cool. And we have the Queen Anne's Revenge sails, and we have the Patreon, which is why you should subscribe to their Patreon, because, I mean, look at this. I mean, as a Laker fan, this just warms my heart. I will be sailing in this at all times, at all times. Um, but look, you can mix and match things. You can do Queen Anne's Revenge and the purple sails. You can do the red sails with the Patreon. You could do the classic with the red sails. I think that actually looks pretty badass. Um, look, you can mix everything up. And obviously, they're going to be adding more and more to this. You know, it'll be part of the shop. And I'm sure you'll be able to earn it in some way. 
So after you buy your ship, it goes straight into your chest and you see we have this new layout here and you'll see you have the stats of your ship right here. It works the same way. You just grab it, you come over here, toss it on in the water and boom, there we go. Let's get on here. Now let me give you a little tour of the man of war because there were people asking about it. Um, so, you know, it works the same as all the other ships. You got your anchor, you pull it up, you put it down. The only difference here is when you put your sails down, you do have three different spots that you have to angle them. So you have one over here, you have one in the middle here, and you have one over here. And there you go. And they actually fixed the wheel. This is something that I asked them. The wheel was really big and low. So it was tough to kind of, you know, do it with like one hand or just like, you know, maneuver it in general. So I think it looks really good now. And I just think everything looks great in general, especially this Patreon skin. So as of right now in this Patreon build, when you leave the lobby and come back, uh, your ship will still be in your chest. Like it's not like you lose it when you leave. Uh, it's only if it gets destroyed and you can also see here that you can scrap the ship and get some gold back so you just click that it blows up your ship you get some gold uh so i lost about like seven thousand gold on that ship because it was worth 2500 i got like 1900 back or 18700 so um yeah that's pretty much it so guys it was a short one for today i hope you enjoyed the entire video i had a lot of fun making it i'm really excited for all of this to come to the base game like i said make sure you join the sale discord it's going to be below in the description because that's how you can become a tester that's how you can find out more about patreon and how to join and you can do all this stuff before everybody else and like i said before the tester build uh, you don't have to pay for that. It's just free, and you just sign up for the role in the Discord, and you get access to it, and this will be coming to that soon, all this ship customization stuff. So you can try it before a lot of people, before it's in the base game, help with bugs, help with anything like that. So, once again, thank you guys for watching. I love you all, and I hope to see you out in the seas. I'll see you next time.